stop shaking, man. <laughs> Woo. Oh, that was awesome. The shot wasn't, but this part is awesome. Oh, man. What's happening everyone? I'm in Dallas, Texas, but I have two deer hunts coming your way right now in this episode. I start in Michigan and I shoot a buck up there with Terry and then I jump in the truck, drive through the night to get to Ohio with Scott and then I end up shooting my biggest bow buck with Scott in Ohio. Both of these hunts are during the rut. Both of them, I was using Conquest Sense VS1 that drew both of these bucks in. So I'm real excited about that, but Look, this is, this is what the hotel room kind of looks like when you hit the road during the fall. Got the monitor with me, water burger for, for supper last night. You know what it is, I'm in Texas, I gotta have it. So kind of got this place a little bit trashed, but that's what happens. Anyways, so yeah, that's enough of showing you guys how messy I am. Welcome to Common Man Outdoors. My name is Jordan Spencer, and I am in Dallas, Texas. Like I said, what we have going on here is we are shocking L&M Lake and Golf Retreat. We're gonna see if there's any big bass left after their drought. Lojo's meeting up with me. Mike's gonna be down there. Brad's gonna try and catch up with us. So that's why I'm here in Dallas. But this episode about two bucks from two different states in 24 hours. Let's go ahead and get into that. I'm starting in Michigan. What's happening everyone? It's the annual trip up to Michigan, up here in Deer Camp. I'm excited. It, uh, temperature is good right now, it feels good, but it's supposed to drop down to 28 degrees. So it's gonna get right. Just need to shoot the bow a little bit, make sure we're still on. Yep, and it's time for redemption. I missed that buck last year. So not gonna happen again this year. I feel good, confident. We're gonna hopefully take our time, but excited to be here. Let's go hunt. He's coming down the hill. Where'd he go? Yeah, I think that's one of the eight Terry Sacks shoot. Here we go, here we go. 
he's done now. Ooh. Oh, I hate that, but man. It's all kind of hit me right now. I'm shaking because two things. Just shot a buck in Michigan. It's been a while. I missed one last year. And it's cold. My Florida blood's cold, but... <laughs> oh, man, you never want to hit them bad like that. And every time I let an arrow fly, I have bad intentions. I felt good. I felt like I was holding good. And unfortunately, sometimes it happened. Got a follow-up shot pretty quick, so... And he put his head down. He's done. <laughs> oh... I can't stop shaking, man. <laughs> Whew. Oh, that was awesome. The shot wasn't, but this part is awesome. Oh, man. Thank you, Terry. I love it up here. Whew. I got to calm down. I mean, oh. <laughs> thank you, Lord. Thank you. Lord. Their purpose isn't wrapped up in that. Right. You know what I mean? Well, a great example of how difficult... For 20 miles, continue straight. Getting set up here. Scott's going to park the buggy. A lot of scrapes, a lot of signs over here. So this should be good. It's the rut in Ohio. And if you're seeing all the stains on my hoodie here, compliments of kip over red arrow we decided to have mexican for lunch so probably not our best decision but i spilled queso all over this thing we'll see it was good we'll see how good it is here in about an hour but rut's on here in ohio i'm excited I'm fired up to be here
He's gonna go down. Oh. That's a big deer. It's, it's the big one. That's a good deer. Oh my god. I made a good shot, right? Yeah, you was on him. I felt good. It looked good. Oh man. It sounded good. It hit it hard. Well, we're getting ready to go look for this buck. Scott's getting the buggy ready. We decided uh, last night, we did get on some good blood. Uh, even though we had a lot of blood, we decided to back out. It dropped down to 33 degrees last night. So meat wise, we're good. We just gotta go find them now. Fingers crossed. I feel good about the shot. Feel really good after watching the footage. I'm, I'm almost positive I got at least one lung and liver and then gut, so. We'll see what happens. Fingers crossed. Let's go find it. Good. See you. Good. Wait, you see the deer? Yeah. No way. Get out. Are you kidding me? Get out. Are you kidding me, Scott? Get out. What is going on? Get out. I just about dropped my camera. Get up. Look up on the bank. On the bank. Oh my gosh, he's on the road. We couldn't oh see him through the sunshine. I told you he'd run down here. That's him. Dead. Dead. God, he's a giant. I told you. He'd be, oh I told you God. he'd come out the flat. And he'd either come down this road or the other way. Holy <laughs> cow. Are you kidding me? That's him. He's a giant. Dude. Look at the mass I told on you he was thick. He's all tied up. Okay, oh my gosh. I got easy pets over here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I don't even know where to start. He's so awesome. Oh. <laughs> Man. Look at the mass on his bases. Yeah. Oh my god. You can't hardly get your hand around. He's beard. awesome. <laughs>